Tim arrives at the CMU campus for the first time. He is supposed to attend an information session on indoor navigation technologies in room 118. Tim decides to use his Android phone with a personal indoor navigator, or PIN, to help him find a route to this room from his current location. As Tim moves through the building, PIN is gathering readings from Wi-Fi access points and Bluetooth beacons, sending fingerprints to the server and in turn displaying updates of the phone's current location, indicated here by the orange and white star. Upon arrival to his destination, Tim discovers the meeting has been moved to a different room. Luckily, PIN makes it easy to navigate to the new location. Since the phone's current location is always known, after a simple selection of the new destination, a new route can be displayed to him. PIN handles multiple floors by initially guiding Tim to the ideal path for getting to the next level, which is designated here by flag number two. Tim follows the route to the second floor, and while doing this, PIN will automatically switch the view to the second floor route. As he enters the hallway, Tim ends up getting distracted and thrown off route midway through. However, this is not a problem for Pin. Not only does Pin update current location by continuously gathering fingerprints, it will automatically update the route to the destination as well. So once Tim has finished with his detour, he can refer back to PIN, where an updated route is displayed for him. He is able to continue on without worry. PIN has navigated Tim successfully and efficiently to his indoor navigation info session. <laughs>